baby mama house Good luck trying to find shit I switch some Glocks out ay, ay. Watch niggas think I cotton mouth Nigga for the money Back door thirsty to sell you out ay, ay. Money low Bitch check it out Got the room for five whole days And I'm checking out Me and we What's good, y'all? It's your main man, Daquan, and I'm back with another video for y'all. And in this video, we're going to be asking a question of should you buy the BMX bike in 2K22? Now, you're able to buy this bike on both next gen and current gen, but I'm going to be testing it on next gen. But this bike is 65K, 70K for some. But the five things we're going to be testing in this video are the turning compared to the skateboard, the top speed, the appearance, hill climbing and last but not least a race between the two but let's go ahead and start off with the turning of the bmx bike you see we're standing on the little black line both our feet now we're going to be starting right there going all the way to the end of the street we're going to be weaving through the poles you see the left one is going to go forward and then so on but let's go ahead and start this thing off now the bike you see it got two wheels now we're turning with our arms with the skateboard we gotta turn with our feet so it might be a little bit harder but let's see now it's looking a little it's looking pretty good right now no worries you see we had to make a little wide turn right there we had to adjust once the speeds picking up but for the most part it's looking smooth you see we, we ran into the pole right there all good hit the wall a little bit all good but for the most part it's looking gravy you see 35 Point sixty-seven. Now let's see what this skateboard is talking about. Now they're giving you this bitch right here for free on both current gen and next gen. So let's see if it's better than the BMX bike. Okay, it's looking smooth. Again, the BMX bike had two wheels. Look, this bitch is terrible. Look, look, look. Got us out here running into the benches and shit. Again, them four wheels are terrible. We're turning with our feet. BMX bike we're turning with our hands so already this shit is trash right here bike already winning with the turning clearly we might as well go ahead and speed this bitch up and trust me I did a couple other turning tests with the BMX bike and skateboard the BMX bike came out on top every single time so first one going out to the BMX bike clearly winning in the turning category next we're gonna go with the top speed now for this one, we got a just a straightaway down the little path. We're on the black line. We're gonna start in three, two, one. Three, two, one. We off to the races. Now for the, the bike, you have the option of putting on this accelerator thing or top speed perk. And I chose the top speed to add to the bike. Now again, we might as well go ahead and speed it up. We're just going in a straight path. We took a little turn. We're still going straight. As soon as we hit this wall, we're going to go to a stop. You see what we do. 46.62. Now, let's see what this skateboard talking about. Now, with the bike, we got two wheels and two legs. With the skateboard, we got four wheels and one leg. But the wheels, we got some tiny ass wheels. Let's see what this skateboard talking about, though. 46.62 with the bike skateboard off to a okay start you can't really tell a difference if we just looked at this one and looked at this one maybe if they're side to side that's probably something i could have done but again let's speed it up now already the bike won we could tell but look it's not it's not too bad of a difference though like if we was going this same distance to just somewhere we needed to go then I'm pretty sure you would not notice a six second difference. Let's be honest here, but we on to the next one, the appearance. Now again, remember the skateboard comes free. Everybody's gonna have it. So if you do wanna look a little different than everybody else, you gotta spend that 65K. So let's see if it's worth it. Now when asking a question of, should you use the skateboard or the BMX bike? We're basically asking a question of, do you wanna look like Tony Hawk or the little kid from your block? riding around on a bmx bike now with the skateboard you can kind of show off your fit a little bit more you're standing up compared to the bike where you're kind of sitting down the bike is covering up your whole body so that is one thing i'll give to the skateboard but 
the bike just looks kind of clean though like look how we sitting we just chilling right now and you can kind of see the bike a little bit more than the skateboard the the bottom is on the bottom the top is on the top we're standing on the top compared to the bike where we can do the wheels we can do the body like just all that shit you feel me so i kind of feel like this is an opinionated one but we got to give it to the bike bro we we got to now the bike is basically winning 3-0 right now let's see if the skateboard can make a comeback this one gonna be an interesting one you see we're standing on the line but why i say that is because we're giving more power with the skateboard with our legs with this one we're just pedaling with the little pedals like look dude still got the the bike in second gear or last gear i don't even know but look man's taking his time you need to hit the gas like they need to add a damn mountain bike climbing hills with a bmx bike that just ain't it but 21 97 let's see if the skateboard can make a comeback right here i'm confident in it 21 97 is what we got to beat with this thing but again we're pedaling with our foot we're pushing so is we're low-key giving more power let's see look already already there we go skateboard making a comeback 21 97 in the dust we beat that 12 to 66 let's see if the underdog the skateboard can take it hill climbing skateboard appearance top speed turning to the bmx bike last but not least we're on to the race now the top speed and turning you might think will determine that the bmx bike will win but let's see let's see you never know but the route we're gonna be taking for this race we're gonna be going all the way around this thing right here let's see and find out what's gonna happen leave your comments in the comment section who you think is gonna win also while you're down there go ahead and like the video but you see we were standing on the line let's go ahead and start this thing off now i'm not gonna show the whole thing because bruh we're going straight so we're gonna speed this thing up now again remember the bmx bike won in both the turning and the top speed but with the way the skateboard turns it kind of takes like a wider angle so if we time it right you never know you never know and also this one it's like a marathon not a race you see 123 70. now we haven't seen the skateboard go very long distance we are about to right now though let's see if it can kick it into the third gear or the fourth gear whatever you want to call it but it has kind of that slow start we've seen in the top speed one but let's see if it again can pick up again those angles with the, the skateboard pop that look kind of clean i know it's, we're spe we're speeding up the video but you never know bruh but 21 23 and damn it's not gonna look like the skateboard skateboard is gonna come out on top sadly enough but we are spending again 65k 70k for a damn bike in a virtual video game that's damn near a third of the amount of vc it costs to upgrade your build you feel me so it, it only makes sense that the bike is gonna win in almost a majority of the different tests we were running but comment on the video which equipment you think we should test next because i know they got the little go-kart we didn't we haven't hit level 40 yet we had to switch from current gen to next gen but i know they got the skates and the scooter as well so just let me know in the comment section but if you enjoyed the video make sure you like comment and subscribe and i'm out